Hi guys, my name is Gwyneth James Girl, and today we're going to take a little look at the architect homes that were released into Sims Free Play with the daycare update at the beginning of April 2017. We got nine new architect homes and we're just going to tour them all and see if we've got any cool items or if any of them seem to be kind of worth building. I hope you're all getting on really well with our quest. No, it's not a quest, is it? It's an event. Uh, my issue is going to be constructor coins at the moment, I think. Like, as you can see, I'm progressing quite well along. This is nothing to do with the architect home, so I just thought I would just quickly update you in terms of how I'm getting along. I'm doing well. I've nearly unlocked everything in terms of the prize progress. And in terms of, like, the items, I'm doing quite well with them. As you can see, though, it is my most constructor coins. That is the issue. I don't have very good luck when I spin that constructor coin wheel thingy my bob, whatever it is. But anyway, that is not what this video is about. This video is about the architect home, so we're going to take a look at all of them. As normal with these videos, don't take pay any attention to how much they cost and how long they take. For me, it will be completely different for you than it is for me, depending upon how many things you've built in your town already. So here's the first house. This can be built on a standard size lot, and it's just, oh, it's just a little one, one door? One door house, I was going to say, one floor. One floor house. I really feel kind of a bit disconnected from Sims Free Play at the moment. If you don't know, I've, I talk about this in every video, but I've not got my phone at the moment, so I've not got my main Sims Free Play game. This is my second game. So I feel very disconnected. I haven't actually played the game properly for over a month. It's kind of killing me a little bit inside, to be quite honest. But here we go. Let's have a little, little look. I like this house. A little to toddler kind of play area. Oh, no, it's not a toddler play area. It's a toddler bedroom. This is cute. I really like this. I like that bed. What's that bed from? Is it from like the homestead or something that... I don't think I've used it because like I say I haven't had my game. <laughs> but this is... This is a nice little build. It's a very simple... Oh, I love this. I think this is my favourite... Favouritest item that was has ever been released into Sims Free Play. This hanging... Uh, like spice... Pot thing. I just love it so so much. So much. Like I can't even explain how much I love that. It's amazing. Let me know actually down below in the comments. Have you got like like one favourite item that has been released into Sims Free Play? Let me know down below. Or one sort of style of furniture or something. But that was the first house. It's got quite a few things in actually. It's quite nice. If you did miss out on any of that homestead, I think it's called homestead. If you did miss out on any of that, maybe you might want to build this house. It's a cute little house. The second architect home, again, standard size lot can be built on. We've got a nice big pool here with the Serenity Rains thing and a bar uh what have we got oh it's all sort of like open plan um this is um <laughs> i couldn't speak then i was just like blah, 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 blah. Uh, this, this is one of my favorite wallpapers i like that wallpaper it's quite nice it's got a little boom box out there oh look they've forgotten to tile that floor never mind let's go up yeah we've got an upstairs this is nice to be honest it's kind of very simple and there's not mass, like, loads to it, but it's a nice little build. It's the style. It's that kind of homestead. Am I using the right word? I might not be, but you know what I mean. That kind of homestead feel. Looks nice. I'm not sure about those spa windows. I don't, I just don't understand them. They just look like a shack, don't they? Well, I think they just look like a shack that, like, a di dilapidated, is that the word? Dilapidated, like a, a broken down building. Here's the third house. Is this a, yeah, this is a standard size as well. We've got, whoa, we've got three floors here, okay. We're getting, we're getting bigger as we go along. That is an LP kennel, I'm pretty sure. Is this a remodel of something, maybe? Mm, I don't know. Huge, like, downstairs open plan area in this little kitchen. I like how that's done, like, the little open, open kitchen. And, well, that is a huge bathroom. <laughs> you can't, like, you couldn't... Is there a toilet in here? Well, there is, oh, yeah, there is a toilet. Like, all those windows, look, you were just going to the toilet. And people could look in from the pool. That, that's not very practical, whoever built this. <laughs> Let's go upstairs. Oh, we've got lots of, of the fish, fish bowls, fish tank things. They're only available for real money. In fact, I don't know if they're available anymore. I keep saying that. I'm not entirely sure. You used to have, you could used to only be able to get them if you spent real money. This is a nice little area here. And um, we've got a bedroom. There's nothing. 
like a limited time prize or anything particularly up. But there's there's some nice furniture. Let's go up again. Whoa. Oh, we've got a bar. A bar is worth some LPs or SPs. This is a nice build. And they've got a kid's bedroom up there. That's kind of odd because, like, you'd put your kid to bed. And then, like, you'd want, like, a little party or something. And you don't want to have your party right outside your kid's bedroom, would you? But anyway. Yeah, never mind. <laughs> oh, look at this fourth house. Standard size lot again. This has got three three floors. Wow, look at this. I love this. This is nice. This is a nice build. Look at that. Attention to detail, this is. Like the little walkways and stuff. This is really nice. I love it. I love it. Full of art. I feel like I've built something like this at some point in my house, in my town, in my house, in my town. What happens here? This is all like open. Yeah, see, look, there's like a like a patio outdoor bit there. I just love it. This is nice. No, no rare things or anything or LP things particularly. I don't think, but a really, really nice build. Yeah, I love this. Just look at that. That's awesome. That's that's pretty cool. Whoever did this, well done. That yeah, nice. Moving on to house five. So this is a premium lot. We can't build this on a standard. And oh, okay. So we just have kind of this massive walkway, entrance way. There's two of these fire monkey thing. If you wanted to get some more of those, I think we got one, didn't we? On like a, the birthday or something, or the three year anniversary of Sims we play or something like that. We've got walkways. This is a very odd house. We've got like look these shell lights. Yeah, this is odd. Like, <laughs> I don't know. I like it. It's a little bit different. I like it, but it's very odd. Oh, we've got all of those bookshelves. I love those bookshelves. Next house is a standard size and got a couple of floors. Yeah, we have a couple of floors here. This looks like it's quite a cool house, I think. Oh, we've got some spa stuff. That's nice. I like that bathroom. It's well, it's kind of just a mishmash of things, maybe. But you've got a a rail thing. You might want to build it for that, just for that rail. You only get a rail when you build the spa house, don't you? Oh, it's got a Latin, a Latin fireplace. That might be a a winner for some people. Let's go up. Is that a teleporter? That's a teleporter, isn't it? As opposed to... I thought it was a shower at first. I think it's a teleporter, yeah. I have no idea. This It's quite random and weird. But I quite like it. I don't really understand what the rooms are and why they are what they are. But it's nice. I like this. I love this, actually. actually. This kind of design. I've been wanting... I've seen a few people do this recently. They like incorporate these kind of pillars style. It looks kind of daft when you just sit, like see it on the floor level, but like to look at the whole design of the house, like to me that looks awesome. I think that's that's really cool. Yeah, I love that. That's great. Amazing. We've got this huge bedroom up here. This is cool. Let's have a little look. See, so yeah, so as a whole, how that house looks. That house looks. I think that looks pretty cool. That's some good design in there. Awesome. From the front. It's kind of like they forgot about it at the back though. It's like it was really good at the front and it's like ah sorry no one can see the back. We'll just concentrate all the energy at the front. Here's the seventh house. Oh my goodness this is huge. Right uh, so not a standard size lot. Obviously this is premium. We've got lots of fish tanks so if you want some fish tanks this could be a house to build. There's so much going on. Oh wow. Yeah this, this is good. I like this. A lot going on in the back garden as well. The house is just a standard house, like in terms of the size of the house, I think. Whoa. There's like, it's so busy. There's so much going on. We've got an aerobics thing, a DJ booth. So much. Wow. Upstairs, there's so many floors. Oh my goodness, I've got the kitchen upstairs. There's so much in this house. Oh, cool, look at it. Look how bright and colourful and awesome that looks. I love the look of the house. Let's see what it looks like from the back. 
Does it look so cool? Here's the eighth house, complete contrast to the last house. This is going to be built on a standard size lot. And very kind of brown and... I don't know really. This doesn't... Oh, we've got a fish tank. Uh, is this... Are they apartments? I think maybe they're apartments. Wow, okay, look at that. Do you know I mean? That, lo that looks cool from the outside. That looks pretty awesome. I think it's just like a big apartment building, isn't it? It looks, yeah. I think the trick is hard to do this, I find, and there's not many people that do it well, is like to design like the outside to look amazing, but plus have a good inside. This is cool. Yeah, it is. It's just apartment buildings or flats, whatever. This must have took eight. Like, think how long this must have taken to build. That's taken a long, long time to build that. That's, uh, yeah, I like that. Nothing particularly worth LP or anything in it, but it is a cool build. I mean, obviously, you've got your SP windows and that there, but other than that. And here we have the last house, standard size lot again. And I think, yeah, we come in from this from the side. Look at all this, like, the decoration. It's awesome. Huge, like, just downstairs, one room area. Let's head down. So we've got stairs up and down. Let's go down to the base. Whoa. So it's not what I was expecting down in the basement. Loads going on down here. Oh, we've got, like, pinball and arcade things. And so maybe people might want to build for this and oh look at that I love that like that's it's not functional I don't think with a painting like that but I love how they put like the chair in front of it exercise bike that was a limited time prize from the seniors quest I believe lots of sparse stuff here right, let's let's go no nothing no nothing massively well let's go up to the next floor and some spa furniture and we've got that mirror which was a limited time prize from was it actually I'm not sure whether I'm right in saying that I think it potentially was a limited time prize maybe I'm thinking of the hidden unicorn painting I'm not entirely sure and, oh we've got another floor I wasn't expecting to be able to go up again are these all separate apartments I feel like these are separate apartments too yeah, yeah, look, they're like a separate, oh, another floor as well, yeah, look, like, there's, yeah, that's like a different style of apartment buildings, isn't it? What have we got on the top floor? Yeah, they're just kind of exactly the same in terms of, like, kitchen, bathroom, yeah, where they all are, just sort of styled differently. So there you go guys, that completes a little tour through all of the new architect homes that we have currently got in the game let me know down below if you'll be building any personally i don't think i probably will be doing the main reason why i build these architect homes is if there's some lp items or something that i didn't manage to win although generally i've managed to win most of the limited time items but that's kind of why i build the architect homes let me know also how you're getting on with the event down below and what you are thinking of it and thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys soon bye